It's ski season here in the Northeast, but do you actually know what goes into producing snow artificially at ski mountains? Well, we're about to find out. Snow can be made artificially by forcing water and pressurized air through a snow gun. But in order to make snow, you need very cold and dry conditions. For this reason, we need to take into account both the temperature and what we call the wet bulb temperature. This is the temperature read by a thermometer covered in a water soaked cloth when air moves over it. Because the wet bulb temperature takes into account the temperature and the humidity, this helps give us an idea what would happen when water and pressurized air are shot out of of the snow guns at the same time. The more moisture is in the air, the less moisture the air can absorb, and therefore you always want a low wet bulb temperature or very cold and very dry conditions. If the conditions are right and it is cold and dry enough, then the water and air pumped out through the snow guns crystallize to make snow. Now, although temperatures well below freezing are really ideal for snow making, you can still make snow at temperatures slightly above freezing as long as the air is very dry. I hope you enjoyed this video. Be sure to check out more of our first warning explainer videos at WNYT.com slash FWE. Thanks for watching.